Okay, now let's put my invention and Kat's alibi to the test. Take it away, detectives. Were you drunk on the night of the fire? Yes. Why were you drunk on the night of the fire? Because I was leaving a party. I don't think this thing is working. Cuff is still in beta. It'll be fully functional by the time it launches. Let's try someone else. Erica, you're next. How many siblings do you have? Two biological, two spiritual. Okay, one more neutral question to confirm our set point. What's your major? I'm designing my own major, tentatively titled The Study of Myself. Where were you the night of the fire? Yes, I was outside the administration building, jumping into the fountain, nude, to both celebrate and subvert the Jewish mikvah tradition at the end of my menses. Wow, so you really were there when the fire started? Yes, I was. I almost passed out immediately from the smoke inhalation. I saw my entire life flash before my eyes in reverse. And just as I was going right back into my mother's birth canal, a figure, God, the universe, call it what you want, put her hand on my shoulder and said to me, not now, Erica, not now. Well, I think this device is hardly qualified to determine the veracity of claims about the afterlife. Okay, after you passed out and all, did you see anything? Yes, as I have told all of you and the press, I saw a hooded figure exiting the back door of the building. I mean, I guess we all just thought you were lying because, you know, you're like always lying. I believe everything I say. Hold on, the police already determined that she was lying. Maybe Cuff can't work out her creative interpretation of truth. Fine, don't believe me. I'll tell you exactly what I told the authorities. It was dark and hard to know for sure, but if I had to take a guess as to who the person was, I'd say Wilson. Professor. Not now, Simon. It's about Margot Miller. Hello. Yes. Thank you. <clears throat> Thank you. Class, I'm happy to announce that Margot is awake. She's too fragile for visitors just now, but the important thing is, she is awake. I really did think she was going to die. I still think we should follow every lead, okay? Let them focus on the Wilson thing, the whole Margo waking up, and we keep digging on the reigning suspects. Okay, but who's left? Hey! Uh, do you want to come to a party with us tonight? <laughs> so are you coming, or? Okay. 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 <laughs> Buena vela. Remembered my birthday. Yeah, you would be a Scorpio. Look, were you the one that posted that video of Cat? If I had found that video, I would have told you first. We had a deal. I mean, geez, think of the traffic. It's practically meme status by now. You know me. 
I'm a man of my word. And with this, I promise not to post a thing about your precious cat. I was like, I don't know, but in retrospect, I think it has to do with my low-grade pyromania that implicated me. There was? Uh, I don't know if you're familiar with my YouTube show. It's called The Meltdown. <laughs> oh, Danny boy, you are everything. What? You broke into my hospital room? Are you insane? They said you weren't allowed any visitors, but I had to see you. I want to figure out who set the fire. Me too. I just don't remember anything. I've been working around the clock and I was totally fried. Digitizing Moynihan's research? Yeah, the school is trying to get all the old faculty members to move from paper files to the cloud. That'd be super straightforward when I volunteered, but it ended up being a nightmare. Things weren't syncing up and so many rows of data. It made my brain fuzzy. Wait, what wasn't syncing up? The data. I told Simon and he just told me to enter everything as is. So are you saying Cuff's algorithm doesn't work? No, just that I couldn't make it work. Hmm. So you didn't know about any of this? No. I just... Thought you should know, since, at least from Margot's perspective, the algorithm might not work. Meaning cuff might not work. Right. I wasn't sure if I should tell you or not. I'm glad you did. I'm sure it's nothing, though. You know, I'll get to the bottom of it. Just don't tell anyone in the meantime, okay? Yeah. We need to talk. <laughs>